So I friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So in this video I will talk about J mains 2021 that is the last attempt marks versus percentile. Uh, here you will also get the expected cutoff marks that is category wise how much marks you need to score at least to, to be eligible for the J advanced examination is to qualify for the J advanced examination that I will talk category wise that is for general AWS OBC SC ST and here I will talk about the August attempt that is the last attempt as you all know the last attempt of the exam will take place from 26th of the August till 2nd of the September and uh, for that you will get the get the admit card very soon so I am making this video uh, to provide you a safe a score you should target for the next attempt to get a good college for yourself and here by watching this video you will know about the safer score that you should at least a score and for each each type of paper i will discuss that is the difficulty level tough moderate and easy uh, so that you can prepare according to that because there will be different type of paper as you have seen in the july attempt also there was there was difference in the difficulty level i will discuss about all type of difficulty level and i will provide you the marks for corresponding percentile in the difficult uh, different difficult Multi-levels. So, if you are first to my channel, please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get all the update about J mains and J advanced other counseling, other entrance exam also in this channel only. So, please try to subscribe and share this video to your friends so that they can also get this get this information. And I have already uploaded so many video about the NIT, Triple IT, GFTI cutoff. You can check that video in the I button as well as in the description box also. And one more video that is percentile versus your category rank. That is the most important video you should watch. So, let's start this video. So, here is the expected cut off marks that you should at, at least score in the upcoming attempt to be eligible for the J advanced exam that is category wise I will discuss here for moderate paper tough paper and easy paper so uh, so I will discuss for moderate paper you can check the tough paper and easy paper side wise so for general 120 plus marks you have to score at least to get the to be eligible for the J advanced examination if the paper is moderate try to listen it carefully if the paper is moderate if it is tough then 95 plus marks and if it is easy then you have you may have to score 130 uh, 138 140 marks also as you have seen in the 25th july shift 2 attempt the paper of that attempt was so easy so that a student got very less percentile after after a scoring good marks also so you can expect same thing can be happen in the next attempt also and for obc 88 plus for moderate paper and tough and easy you can check sideways so what i am advising is try to improve your accuracy plus a speed if the paper is tough then your accuracy will help otherwise if, if the paper is easy then your speed will help so, so try to work on that in the last days if your preparation is good so if for ews 86 plus marks for moderate paper and for sc 57 plus and for st 45 plus so this is the marks that you need to score at least to be eligible for the J advanced exam that means to qualify for the J advanced examination so now i will talk about the marks versus percentile that is only for the last attempt and that is expected and i will talk about all type of paper that is moderate tough and easy so so here is marks versus percentile expected so for all type of paper so for 99 to 100 percentile for moderate paper you have to score at least 265 marks it may be 270 also and for tough 255 plus and for easy 280 plus 290 also that is uh, that is never a guarantee you have to score so much higher marks to get the get a higher percentile so for 99.8 to 99.9 .9, your marks should be 252 plus if the paper is moderate and for tough and easy you can check sideways and for 99.6 to 99.8 your uh, your marks would be 243 plus for moderate paper and for 99.4 to 99.6 your marks would be 230 plus 232 plus and for 99.9 to 99.4 percentile your marks would be 220 plus for moderate paper and for 98.5 to 99 your marks should be 209 plus for the moderate paper and i am providing this information based on the last attempt and the considering the difficulty level of the next attempt and also the competition because the student go with the more preparation as they have got some time from the last attempt to the next attempt so you can expect there will be more competition and the difficulty level of the paper will also be increased so next is for 98 to 98.5 198 plus marks will be required and for 97.5 uh, uh, and above you have to score 187 or above marks for moderate paper and for 97 to 97.5 your marks should be 160, uh, 176 plus and for tough and moderate you can check sidewise by pausing this video so next is 96 to 97 165 plus for moderate paper and tough and easy you can check sidewise so next is 
some more data for marks versus percentile that is i will talk all the way till 40 percentile because there are some student who are from pwd and the student are from scst though the student can get the good college with lesser percentile so next is for 95 to 96 145 per marks will be required for moderate paper and for 93 to 95 your marks would be 132 plus and for 90 to 93 your marks would be 120 plus and for 85 to 90 your marks would be 108 plus and for 80 to 85 your marks would be 98 plus and for 75 to 80 your marks would be 89 plus and for 70 to 75 your marks would be 82 plus and for 60 to 70 your marks would be 75 plus for moderate paper and for 50 to 60 percentile 55 plus marks will be required and for 40 to 50 your marks would be 43 plus so this is the marks versus percentile expected for the last attempt uh, so you can really trust this data i have considered all the factor and i provided the similar marks versus percentile expected for the third attempt also uh, one month earlier so that was that data was was almost accurate so you can trust this data and prepare according to this for the next attempt so that you can get the good percentile for you and you can get good uh, good calls in the upcoming counseling so so thanks for watching this so please try to subscribe this channel uh, so that you will get all the information about j mains j advance in other counseling other entrance exam also in this channel only so please try to subscribe and share this video thanks